Dragon Boat BC is proud to partner with Steve Nash Fitness Club to provide a series of paddling specific exercise videos. Shirea, a Steve Nash Fitness Club personal trainer, along with Jeanette and Johnny, two paddlers from our premier team at Dragon Zone, to demonstrate exercises that you can incorporate into your paddling fitness regimen. In this third video of the series, we will focus on mobility with an emphasis on the hips and shoulders. So as we're using our Hyper Ice Ball, it's vibrating and it's actually playing with your nervous system. It's getting all the muscles to fire properly and it's actually going to help increase your range of motion. So through this, it's going to help your shoulders. As you bring that ball back, you're going to be able to get it farther and farther towards the floor. This is a really, really great exercise to do pre-workout. This, this is a single leg loop bridge. We're utilizing the Viper Hyper Sphere Ball. The vibration is going to actually work with your nervous system, aligning all of your muscle fibers, making everything work together and actually fire properly and increase your range of motion. It's going to help you be able to fire your glutes a little bit more. You want to try and pinch that hypersphere ball between your quad and your stomach. You're going to bring your feet a little bit wider yeah, than your hip width. Great. Arms out nice and wide. You're going to drop your hips to one side and then you're going to take your right foot over top. That's wonderful. This is uh, going to be a hip opener, helping your internal rotation. Uh, it's going to stretch out your glute medius as well as your tensor fascia latte. So if we do the other side, and you can hold this stretch for about 20 to 30 seconds aside. It's going to be really, really good for your hips. All right, Jeanette, so we're going to do a dowel warm up with your shoulders. So from, yeah, there we're going to bring it all the way back. Yeah, great. So I'm going to bring it all the way down as far as you can. Good. And then all the way back around. During this movement, we want to keep our arms nice and straight, so if we need to, widen our grip. That's great. And as we come up, we want to work through those sticky parts, bringing it all the way back around. During this, I also need to make sure you keep your core engaged nice and tight so that we aren't hyperextending in the lower back. 